With this tool, you can find up to 99% of new token launches before they are started. Hi, it's Christoph Dreiger. In this video, I'd like to present you a Signals widget part of a LumosPad project. Let's log in to the LumosPad. We use MetaMask login and we are on a dashboard page. Here we can add widget. In this example, we will add a Signals widget or Ethereum. We set some name, then we select Signals and click Save. We can easily change the size of any widget on our dashboard. After loading, we can see a list of signals, a list of tokens that are about to launch or they have just been launched on a blockchain. We can find many useful information For example, we can see the token's name. We can find information whether this token was created a few hours ago. The new batch will inform you about it. We can add token to favorites. We see the token address. We can easily open the explorer. For example, Etherscan or BSC scan. We can also copy the address. Another useful information is a owner, tokens owner balance, current balance. As you can see in this example, there's two Ethereum, 2.4 Ethereum balance which is pretty standard. However, sometimes you may find some very big um, balances, like tens or more. This could be suspicious because there are many bots that um, have uh, very big balances and they create new tokens every hour or so. <laughs> so this is token balance information. Other information is, for example, the social links. We analyze the tokens source code, trying to find any links related to the project. If we find, for example, Telegram token, Telegram link or Twitter link, we can display it here and you can use the link to preview the, for example, project's Telegram account. Another thing you can find on a Signals widget list is a scam badge. This highlights tokens that their owners or creators created and other tokens in the past and they removed liquidity completely from the tokens. This highlights very high possibility that the token, this token, may be a scam again. So this is the information this is useful information that you can use uh, and skip the project if you see this badge. Another extra badge is this triangle. We also scan tokens source code 
for honeypot codes. For last months we've been researching many many tokens and we found some source code that if used in a token source code it makes the token a honeypot. This is an example. If you see this triangle you should definitely skip the token. Other details are for example how many minutes or seconds before liquidity was added the signal widget displayed this token. Next we have a liquidity status liquidity change from the launch. Next very very useful information we have token taxes simulation in place which calculates the, the, the token taxes from the first block after launch let's see this example we can see that the taxes were simulated trading isn't isn't opened yet and we can see if a token launch right now in a block zero we would have 0 0.5 buy tax and 0 0.5 around 0 0.5 sell tax let's see another example this is a smart contract with tax simulation with very high taxes the buy tax 20 percent the sell tax around 50 percent as you can see notification says that the smart contract has changed this means that the token owner most likely sent some transaction maybe changing the taxes maybe something else but we do a rescan of the contract in a real time it takes some seconds so we need to wait for new values because this current values might not be up to date We have another example. In this case, the trading is already opened. So this is a calculation, not a simulation. So there's our current taxes set on a token. You can see there are many simulations, many tokens. Uh, we have some additional information such as trading activator, max transaction value or max wallet uh, values. We can try to find some. In this case, we have a two tokens as a max transaction. Another example, also very important, the trading isn't open yet. The tax has been simulated and we can clearly see that you can buy with 20% tax, but you won't be able to sell. This is clearly a honeypot token. We know that thanks to the trade simulation and we know that before the launch of the token. This is very unique functionality and can be very, very useful for daily traders. Next, let's see what kind of signals do we track. We track the blockchain transactions in a real time. We find, for example, we find airdrops transactions it's often that before the token launch the owner is doing a, a airdrops so uh, he sends tokens to people involved in the project or involved in a pre-sale or something like that 
So airdrops is a signal that the token may be launched very soon. Next, we also track a locks tokens locks, for example, on a pink sale or other services. This is also a signal that the token may be launched very soon. Next, we monitor other bots or snipers that are pointing to the token and they are about to join into the token launch. This signal is called bots. Next, we also track any config changes to the contract, like changing sell or buy taxes or similar transactions. This tells us that owner is preparing the token to launch, so it may be launched very soon. Next, sometimes token gets a liquidity, the liquidity is added, but the token, the trading is not enabled immediately after uh, adding the liquidity. In that case, we also add this signal to our list. So if liquidity is added, but the trading is not enabled, you will see a token signal for that. And the last but not least, but last but not least, is an approved signal. Right before adding liquidity, in most cases, the token's owner must approve the token on a DEX, for example, on a Uniswap or PancakeSwap and so on. We detect this signal if owner or creator of the token approves the token on a DEX, we display this here on a widget, on a signals widget list. This is the most uh, important. I mean, the right after the token is approved, in most cases, liquidity is being added. So if you see approved uh, signal, that means the token might be launched in next few seconds or minutes. You can also select one of three networks, Binance Chain, Ethereum or Arbitrum. You can change the name, you can change the network and save the widget. Widget will refresh with a new list of signals. Please keep in mind that there are many tokens created by scammers. If you use signals widget, you will find hundreds of new launches per day in a bear market. In a bull market, it might be thousands. But please keep in mind that most of these tokens are a scam or honeypots. With LumosPad, we try to reduce your risk of getting scammed. We try to filter and highlight signals and tokens that could be a scam. But as always, do it on your own risk. This is not financial advice. And as always, stay safe. Thank you for watching. Take care.